Capri and I just had our maternity photo shoots, and it was really the first photo shoot that we had ever had as a couple before. Yeah. And we hadn't seen much information about this sort of thing online, so we just wanted to take a moment to sort of share it with you guys, share what the experience was like, and then definitely share some photos with you guys too. Yes, because we did our research before, you know, choosing our location, what we wanted and everything, and we saw a lot of samples of maternity photos. But on YouTube, what we could find was mostly just like, you know, people filming their own experiences, but there were no sit downs explaining really how they felt or, you know, if they were nervous or if they were like excited or what was the deal. And we tried to film the day of the photo shoot, but of course we're so busy. I mean, yeah. we had no idea how much it takes <laughs> to take photos. <laughs> Our first idea, yeah, was like for us not to be sitting down and explaining this, but for this just to be you a, know, vlog. a vlog where yeah. we were out and about with the camera and where we just filmed everything from start to finish and you guys sort of got to see behind the scenes. But it turns out behind the scenes, it's moving pretty fast. You know? <laughs> we had no idea. It, it was so hot this day. It was like 88 degrees and it was so humid and so we were just like huffing it from spot to spot trying to keep ourselves looking good feeling good <laughs> and we really didn't have time to constantly be pulling out the camera although we do have some footage here that we, we should do. show them so go ahead and roll the footage <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, so we're on our way to do something really fun, which is to take our maternity photos. Ryan and I have never done a photo shoot in our lives. As you know, in our wedding, we eloped and we didn't have a photographer or anything. We never did engagement photos. We never had professional photos taken of us. So it's exciting. Ryan is driving. Hello guys. <laughs> and we're on our way. Um, we're doing it in the city center, in the, in the downtown area here in Recife because it's really picturesque and you know, it, I think it'll provide a nice background. And it's something that, I don't know, will be fun. Now we're excited to see it. I'm a little bit nervous because I don't know how to behave in front of the camera. <laughs> I know we vlog. This is the girl hanging out with the camera. <laughs> I know, but we vlog and all, but it's different because you have a little bit more control when you're holding the camera yourself. Yeah. And obviously you're not, it, there's like that pressure behind taking maternity photos that those are gonna be, you know, a huge memory for you. I don't know, it's just like you're, that time that you were pregnant with your baby girl and I don't know, but, but I'm excited above all. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna go great. I'm excited for it. The downtown environment, hopefully we'll find lots of cool little places to film and we'll meet the photographer. Hopefully she's a cool lady. Hopefully yeah. she'll help us get it all directed so it looks good. Yeah, she's the same photographer who took uh, my sister and our brother-in-law's maternity photos as well. So they did it on the beach and we thought about doing it on the beach as well, but I feel like Ryan and I are more city people than we are beach people <laughs> even though we live by the beach <laughs> so right do you agree <laughs> no i totally agree yeah. <laughs> i think this is us you know we'll, we'd rather have our photographs taken in front of graffiti i think than with our toes in the sand I guess. yeah so exactly so i think that we'll, be, the background will be a little bit more fitting to who we are as people and you know hopefully we'll be cool we'll definitely post the pictures on Instagram so make sure to follow us on Instagram at follow the hills if you don't yet so guys we made it to our location Hello. <laughs> <laughs> and we're going to start um, the photos pretty soon here we're just explaining to our photographer this is Hello. Dalila <laughs> and I was just explaining to her what exactly we had in mind we wanted to do something a little bit less posed and more candid I guess with better backgrounds right yeah. so uh, we're excited she's the expert so we'll let her tell us like where the best spots are for lighting and all of that but we had some ideas we shared them with her and now we'll see how it all turns out Vamos Dalila Hola Hola Hey guys so we're having a little break for some ice cream this is a breakdown right now. Yeah. We are so hot, we're melty. It's so hot outside and there's nothing we can do. There's absolutely no breeze. We came into this ice cream shop just to literally cool off and have some water and have some ice cream and see if we can do it. But the AC here is not even that strong. I mean, we're dying outside yeah. a little bit, but we're making the most of it. We're having fun and we hope the pictures turn out really nicely. Yeah. So guys, there you go. That was the All beginning. We did to film. <laughs> that was like the beginning of the photo shoot. <laughs> And right in the middle, our ice cream break. It was so necessary. It was just a chance to cool off. And that was actually where we changed wardrobes. Also. Yeah, that is true. Because it was so funny, guys. So 
to recount the day, uh, what happened is that we met our photographer in the downtown area of, of Recife, where we live, and that's what we talked to you guys, you know, through in the in our what we could film in the in our <laughs> vlog. <laughs> so we actually met her at a scheduled location in downtown, and you know, she was the one who was like, okay, well. Let's go to this location, let's go to that place, let's go to, you know, against that wall or, or however to take the photos because we really wanted to have a gritty city-like look to yeah, our photos. Yeah, absolutely. We talked it through and uh, option number one was definitely to go to some place that was, you know, right by the beach. There's yeah. an area south of town where we live here and it's so picturesque and it's palm Beautiful. trees and ocean and sand. And we liked the idea very much. Right. And it seems to be where most people here are interested in taking their maternity photos. Right. And although they turn out so beautiful there, we just decided that it really wasn't for us. That yeah. we wanted to capture, I think, this Hasifi experience that right. we're having here. And the downtown backdrop, it's just a little bit grittier and it's covered with graffiti, graffiti and but it looks so old fashioned also. You can see all of those like Portuguese influences down there. And it's sort of the way that we wanted to remember our time here while uh, Priscilla's pregnant here with our little one. Of course, because, you know, it's important to, to honor where we are at the moment. Mm -hmm. This is where she's going to be born, and we really wanted to capture that feeling, that downtown Recife feeling, yeah. and I think the photographer nailed it. Yeah, she did a great job. Yeah. She had some ideas for, you know, where she wanted us to go. We had some ideas, and we just tried to sort of marry them together, you know, and right. we're really happy with the results yeah. once we saw them come back. One of the, our major, major ideas was that we wanted photos that weren't posed necessarily. Of course, if you're doing a photo shoot, you do have to pose some, but we wanted mm -hmm. to be very natural and very true to who we are. Um, and, you know, I think the photos really translated to that. Um, yeah. We really wanted to have more of a candid feel to our photos um, rather than just something you know, posed and smiling and looking at the camera. Mm -hmm. So that, that was pretty good. Yeah, so I mean, our advice to you guys is definitely to, you know, do your best to work with your photographer and make sure that if you have ideas that you're vocal about them. Because yeah. I think if we had just let her do what she wanted to do, I'm sure it would have come out really nice and we would have been, you know, quite happy with her ideas. But we feel a lot more confident sharing some of the photos afterward here knowing that, you know, they, they really look how, how we wanted them to look. And even the locations that we ended up choosing, yeah. uh, I think in so many ways it's because you took the time to express to her exactly the sort of feeling that we were trying to capture, then she was able to work with us to try to accomplish that. Absolutely. And I have to say that my favorite photos at the end of the day are the ones that we, like, we're just like in the middle of a sentence or we're talking to each other. Right. We're not like you know, necessarily doing like a pose. There are, there are few that are cute as well, yeah. that you know, we're posing specifically for that photo, but I liked the ones that we're walking or that we're in motion. Those are my yeah. favorites at the end of Let's the day. Let's talk about nerves. How, yeah. how nervous did you feel when you had your belly out and were exposed like that? Yeah, so that is the, that was what we had for our second wardrobe. The photographer had told us that we should have two sets of clothes to, you know, to have like different photos and things like that during the day yeah. and for me the second one she really suggested that I had something that I could expose my back <laughs> <laughs> and guys let me tell you that was nerve-wracking for me because <laughs> we were in the middle of a city with yeah. people walking around and there were hundreds of people yeah, around during cars, some of those, some we had those to, shots yeah. that we got there are some shots that we had to stop you know and like move because there's a car coming and things like that and <laughs> there I am in the middle of downtown with my belly out out for the world to see. And I mean, believe it or not, I'm kind of shy about these things. <laughs> so it's really nerve-wracking. It's funny that you mentioned those scenes with the cars because there are some of our shots that like we would be right in the middle of the road. Any of the ones that it looks no. like we're in the middle of the road, these aren't pedestrian friendly roadways. No. There were always cars coming, so we would wait for cars to pass or wait for there to be a little break, and then we'd run out into the middle of the street, try to look very casual. <laughs> snap, snap. Snap. Let's go somewhere else. <laughs> it really was that, like, and this is why we weren't able to film all of it for you guys. Right. Again, we had grand designs on, like, us out with the camera constantly, but instead, mostly the camera had to stay in the bag with the photographer because 
we were just running to the next spots, trying to capture what daylight there was, because we did this all, it's worth mentioning, in the afternoon. toward the yeah, afternoon and end of the day. So right. we only had like an hour and a half or so that we were working with, and we tried to get to all these different spots and then change wardrobes too, <laughs> because we needed that second wardrobe. We yeah. were sweated after the first one. <laughs> so at the end of the day, yes, it was nerve wracking in many ways and fast paced and hot, but we had so much fun. It was a blast. I would totally do another photo shoot again. Yeah. And I'm already thinking about, you know, like a newborn photo shoot <laughs> and a hospital photo shoot. I don't know why we've never done that before in our lives. I don't know either. <laughs> we, we, we really do have no professional yeah. photos. And I think that uh, the lady, Delilah, she did a very nice yeah. job. So we were, we were quite happy with it here. And we recommend it to you guys, you know. Definitely, if you're interested in capturing the moment, we think that it was really worth it. It was really worth and it. And like Priscilla says, we're already planning the next yeah. one, I think. So we're going to share our favorite favorites with you guys right after this so we hope you enjoyed the video yeah. if you did give it a great big thumbs up and leave us a lovely comment down low let us know what your favorite one was or share a story with us and let us know how your photo shoot went we're very curious to know absolutely and we'll see you guys in our next video enjoy the photos bye, bye.